All right, so sad day today for me because we quite finished late last night. I think it was around nine or something. I cleared out everything from here. So this morning when I came, I had to see that stain over there in that corner. We had to touch it a little bit because we didn't uh, flatten flatten it out completely. So it was just a small bit. So we touch it up. I know the rule. You don't have to touch it up. And uh, then we put a little bit more render on the top just to cover the mess that we were doing. And now I have a, a, a different color on that side. So that is quite bad. Now there are a few options, a few things that I can do, but I believe the best option is to redo the entire thing uh, without taking any shortcuts. But I'm still going to try a little bit to, to put a little bit of uh, that render on just with the brush see if the color is going to change because at the time that we have placed that small bit uh, we have put more render on that small bit uh, the sun went out so it was uh, starting to be quite cold and uh, the color didn't change because once that is going to dry the color is going to go a little bit darker so that one had a little bit more time this other one was a little bit forced and uh, probably that's why I have the, the a different color on that side and it's not nice to see I don't know how good you can see it but I believe you can see it because it's quite sunny and I cannot see it through the LCD but meanwhile I had uh, I have been doing other stuff so I just left that bit so I, I changed the downpipe before it was a metal one you saw that I had uh, to take it out I, uh, and I replaced it with a new plastic one uh, I even cut my window seals, I have them here, I'm not stuck yet, I didn't glue them yet, stick them, because I don't know what is going to happen with the final coat of the render. So, uh, yeah, probably either I'm going to re-render the entire thing or just paint it. So yeah, more work for me, but it is what it is. So yeah. The bottom also, it's ready now, I just need to put some uh, ventilations. The window seal, I've got it. I just need to put it in place and that's it now I will just going I'm just going to leave it like that and see if I can do something about that corner there without re-rendering the entire thing And here we go guys, uh, I am back, I, I've i just got the paint and I'm going to try to solve that uh, ugly stain over there. And yeah, I'm going to use the same paint from Ceresif, silicone, silicone self-clean, 
but this time is paint it's not going to be render is the same uh, like the render but yeah it can be applied on top of this is the CT48 and hopefully uh, I'm going to solve the problem with this uh, paint here I'm going to do the entire house uh, and yeah uh, I strongly believe that is going to cover everything it's already mixed it's the same color so yeah I will have to make that ugly stain over there vanish what can I say in this job uh, I blew it up completely uh, I don't like to admit it but it happens uh, best thing is not to run away <laughs> uh, try to solve the problem as best as you can and yeah I strongly believe that that is going to solve the problem if it's not going to cover then I will have to re-render everything hopefully it's not going to be that the case and uh, yeah um, we are now like about four days later it was raining before was too hot and now it's raining every day and it's still going to rain for whole week hopefully the rain is not going to come anytime soon and it's going to allow that paint to dry off it will need around three hours so okay without any further ado let's just jump up there and paint the entire facade as you can see i already took the pipe out because i don't want any stain on it and yeah let's just crack on All right, so that was done. Now it's looking a lot better. I don't have that stain anymore. It uh, disappeared. Uh, of course, now I will have to put uh, my uh, rainwater pipe on again and the window seals. Meanwhile, I'm just going to leave it to dry a little bit more 
uh, because I can still see some small imperfections like the roller uh, but this is going to dry out and I'm confident that all that is going to disappear so yeah I'm just going to quickly jump on uh, the rain water pipe and install it so let's quickly do that All right, so window seal is on, uh, that down pipe is on, I have to put some, uh, some uh, mastic around that pipe, around that joint, because it wasn't done properly. Uh, the joint over there, it's bigger than the actual gutter, and I just try to repair it with some gutter sealant somehow it's not looking that nice but at least for now it's going to do the job till they are going to change everything I believe they will um, change the guttering and they are going to put some fascia and sew fit over here at a later stage All right, so right now I still have to install another window seal from the from the window uh, on the ground floor, and I believe that is going to be my last job onto this facade. Of course, I will still need to take the towers off, but I'm going to leave it them for now. Uh, the owner is going to put the is going to install the uh, the CCTV back on and uh, yeah meanwhile I'm just going to quickly install this window seal now I already cut them before and now it's quite easy to to lay them All right, guys, so now everything is done. Uh, I have even taken the scaffolding down. 
uh, and I left it for a couple of days um, to see if the stain is going to come back now it's looking a lot better I still can see a little bit uh, on that wall just a tiny bit the stain but my client is okay with it I was trying to re-render everything because I'm a bit ashamed of that and I don't like for people to pass around and just see my work that uh, it's not good enough of course if you don't know about it you are not going to see it uh, you really need to stare at it to see it uh, but yeah I was ready to re-render everything but uh, my client told me that is okay he cannot see it so it's not going to be a big deal I'm a bit sad but uh, yeah I cannot force no one uh, to do stuff that they don't want to I was prepared with everything uh, I even bought all the render and the colors and everything ready to go but uh, yeah so this is the end of our video and pretty much that's it so anyway if you enjoyed this video if you can see that stain there uh, put a comment down below uh, write something uh, hopefully not that bad but yeah I believe this is the end of our video uh, and don't forget to like and subscribe and of course see you on the next one